strange one uh, today we're going to be doing the tutorial video and the review on the beard struggle stuff I got so that being said uh, I want to give a huge thank you to the beard struggle for allowing me this opportunity to join them and let's go ahead and get started so as you can see the beards a little crazy um, let's go ahead and just jump off with a review of some of the products real quick as I'm going to start using them first ones being the shampoo and conditioner uh, they got multiple scents I went with Odin's Virtue it's kind of like a apple cinnamon kind of wood smell um, the wood really is very potent uh, shampoo and conditioner bottles they are just plastic bottles um, I got the ultimate package I do wish the bottles were a little bit bigger though uh, I don't think these are gonna last me very long now, I know you can get bigger ones but in the ultimate package you just kind of get a it's kind of like a, a starter kit kind of deal um, all the other bottles though for all the oils and everything like that are all glass. They're really nice. I like them So let's go ahead and get started. I'm actually going to wash my beard So we're gonna skip the shower scene and I'll uh, I'll be back here in just a second All right, so I will say this is in the realm as you can hear I got the shower in the background um, They did come in small bottles, but a little goes a long way with these Okay, you really only need to use about a quarter of a size in your hand and then basically you just, you know after your beard's wet you just kind of brush through the beard get it real good wash it out same thing goes with the conditioner white lids conditioner black lids shampoo it's that simple okay anyway welcome back everybody i'm gonna turn this on real quick all right so i'm out of the shower my beard's kind of wet just flick water in my now it's time for some of the other products so, in the ultimate pack, we get two bottles of oil. We have the daytime, which is in the blue bottle, and the nighttime in the green bottle. It's kind of, kind of confusing. It's okay. You also get two beer bombs. Everything's in a glass bottle except for the shampoo and conditioner. Uh, so we have the scruff and the orange. Brown, that's brown. Scruff, beard. Um, yeah, that's about it. And then of course my favorite parts, we have the heat comb, which is currently turning on and heating up. We have the all wood comb with their signia on it and the beard struggle in the back, as well as the brush. I love this brush, I have one myself. Um, obviously but I have one before I joined the beer struggle and mine's a little more coarse than this one which I do kind of like um, I understand why it's softer I do like the coarse one but I use the beard struggle one more now also the great thing about the beard struggle is this right here sorry my light is glaring it says F you cancer with their insignia on it it's awesome also have this lovely shirt I'm sure most of you have seen me wear either during stream or in my other videos and then my beanie to keep my bald head warm because it's cold outside right now. All right. So normally I blow dry my beard out um, to get it a little more dry. I did do that before I went back to the camera here. I'm gonna gotta brush it out a little bit. There we go. All right, we're gonna check the beard comb getting warmer it does take a minute to warm up I do love that it's cordless though so it's entirely cordless uh, USB-C has a lock and unlock right there so that way at any point in time you can just lock it so that way if you're taking it with you on the go it comes with a nice little pouch as well you can put it in the pouch you lock it so that way it doesn't just kick on or something if the button gets held in your bag uh, has a volumizer so if you want to fluff out your beard especially right now because of COVID we got the masks I don't know how many beard people have to deal with this. Uh, I was wearing a regular mask for a while, and I'd always have an indention where the mask went while my beard was sticking out. So, that's about it. All right, so before you use any of the oils or bombs, do the, the heat strainer, if you're wanting to use the heat strainer. Don't do the uh, oils and bombs and then use the heat strainer, because then it can fry out that. And then you risk burning and smelling weird in your beard. All right, perfect. So, we got some light. Go ahead and start brushing my beard out. I have a really 
curly beard because back when I used to have hair, I used to have curly hair. It's kind of bushy. It's kind of curly. We're just going to brush it all out here. Also brushing the mustache through. Um, obviously, I've been using the beard comb here, and frankly, I think it's it's wonderful. I, this thing is awesome. Um, I don't really have any bad things to say so far about any of this stuff. Um, my beard's usually a little too tangled. See, even right now it's tangled. To be able to use this comb very thoroughly. Uh, the heat comb, though, does help me kind of get a lot of the tangle out. Fluffy beard. Alright. Still a little damp. Not a big deal. I'm going to go back over here. As you can see, there's three levels on here. You just hit the button to whatever your desired heat level is. I went all the way up. My beard's still a little wet. And also, I'm going for maximum volume and straightness here. I usually do this before I start to stream. That way, when I start the stream up, you all don't see this gigantic poof of my face. Just kind of take it real slow at start with here. I'm just trying to even everything out, get the backs here. As you can see, I got that tail feather sticking out the back. Use the volumizer under just to help make sure I got no no tangles. I'm tangle free. All right, brush it this way for a second. Perfect. All the tangles are out. My heat went down a little bit because it wasn't quite ready for me. All right, there we go. This is usually a lot easier to do in a mirror as I'm sitting at my computer looking at my phone screen to do this for y'all. So, bear with me. All right, not too bad. Obviously, I need all right, so we got that all done. As you can see, it already looks a lot better than what it did five minutes ago. All right, and I haven't even used any of the oils yet, okay? That's just with the first thing. So it is daytime, we got the blue bottle. Now obviously this has directions on it. It says six to eight drops. It comes with a little, little dropper here for you. So we're gonna go one, two, All right, in the palm of my hand, going to rub it. And then all that hard work I just did on my beard, I am now going to disintegrate. All right, I'm gonna turn off the beard straightener. Now I'm just gonna kind of brush the oil through. I'm gonna use the brush. I get that all the way through everywhere that I didn't, including possibly down here. And I, I do go a little bit more on the oil on the front of my beard. The sides aren't as thick as right here um, for me. So what I do is I don't really use it. I keep some on this thing, on the dropper, and I just kind of stick it through my beard here a little bit. That way it just helps oil out inside my beard. All right, um, now I don't use the bomb a whole lot since, you know, masks and everything, but I'm going to today, let's see, beard bomb, great. Open the lid, get a secondary lid, pop that thing off. Now, we're only gonna use about enough to fit on the tip of my finger. So I'm gonna scrape the top here, got just the tip of my finger, palm of hand, and I don't wash my hands yet. Um, I like that oil residue on it. So I'm going to rub it in. There we go. Perfect. Got some stragglers there. Which is why 
the bar where it's important. We'll close the lid back up. We'll brush it back through. Just like doing here. There we go. Went from giant bush face to at least I look semi-decent for the day. And if I didn't have to wear a mask, it'd be even better. All right, everybody. I hope this helps. Uh, my discount link and code will be in the description of the video. Discount code is strange, obviously. And thank you all so much for hanging out during this video. And I'll catch you all in the next one. Take it easy, everybody.